Hey gang, it's Fred Moore here with another tip for you to help you do so much more. You ever been, you know, wearing a mask and you're out and about and you have to sneeze, right? It's like, you, but you, here's what you can do to stop that. Yes, it's me, Fred Moore, keynote speaker, entertainer, and bald guy. I didn't shave today. Do I have five o'clock shadow up here? Maybe I do. All right, hang on. Maybe this has happened to you. It happened to me, I don't know, a couple of weeks ago. I was out and about. I had my mask. I had my mask on, like, you know, I'm, I'm a good boy, right? Had the mask on, and I had to sneeze. I felt a sneeze coming on. Now, my first instinct was to do this. Right, because you get this, I got this thing, and I want to, I don't want to fill it up with all that gunk and all that. But then that's, you know, defeats the purpose of the mask, doesn't it? Yeah, I was at, uh, was at a very dangerous place, a festering ground for the virus, Walmart. Uh, I love that place, it's great. So I had the mask on, and then I remembered, right, I got to sneeze. I remembered what I used to do when I waited tables. That was the last, quote, real job I had. It's a skill I still have under my belt. But I thought, well, hey, you know, the whole entertainment and speaking thing is kind of on hold right now, so I can go back to my old serving, waiting. No, they're closed too, so I'm not going to do that. Anymore. Don't worry about it. I'm, I'm, I'm all right. I'm okay. But when I used to wait tables, right, if I was coming up with some food, and I felt a sneeze coming on. You, obviously, you don't want to have food that, but that. Here's your burger. Enjoy. <laughs> Secret sauce. Ooh, disgusting. I, I, I didn't want to do that. So I heard this somewhere, I read it somewhere, I don't know. But if you want to prevent yourself from sneezing, all you have to do is grab your throat right here, like your Adam's apple. I know, but I'm a girl, I don't have it. We all have them, okay? It's just that usually men's are more prominent than women's. Some, <laughs> well, okay. But you're gonna grab your throat right here, right? And what that does is it, it because when you sneeze, your throat has to contract somehow to go, right? So if you grab your throat, then 95% of the time, you're not going to sneeze. Now, here's the thing. You're still going to make the face, and you're going to get right up to the point where it feels like you're going to sneeze, but you won't. So you go like this. You'd be like, oh, okay. You look like an idiot because you're like, what the heck? What are they doing out there? That they were gonna sneeze, now he's choking himself, he's not, what's going? Security, get over here, and all that. But yeah, so you'll make the face. You, you know, but if you are in the mask, no one's gonna see the face anyway. All they see is, is this. Right, now that's 95% of the time, you're not gonna sneeze. The other 5%, it's gonna happen. You're gonna sneeze. But here's the problem, you're holding your throat, right? And that sneeze is coming. Doesn't matter. I don't, I don't care if you're holding that throat. So it's going to be like a Mondo Morpheus alien possessed sneeze. It's going to be, who can I set for the bra? <gasps> and your throats, your larynx is going to come shooting out your ears. That does happen to you. Don't worry. Take your larynx, stuff it back in your ears. Just give it a, and you'll be fine. Don't worry about it. It's a simple trick. Simple trick. Like I said, 95% of the time, it works. The other 5%, yeah, not so much. But maybe it's going to save you from a mask full of mooch. Mooch. That's, uh, that's Romanian for boogers. And it's not disgusting. My wife's Romanian. Did I mention that? That's, I'm just not saying. Anything. But that's, yes, that's it. Enjoy and share this with your friends. You know, if you find this tip useful, share it. Hit the like button. Uh, if you're on YouTube, hi, hi YouTube people, yeah, then you can subscribe to get more fun videos like this. But once again, the name is Fred Moore, keynote speaker, entertainer, all that good stuff. That's me, and we'll see you soon. Bye.